Space Academy is a live-action sci-fi children's television program produced by Filmation that originally aired Saturday mornings on the CBS television network, from September 10, 1977, to December 17, 1977. Repeats ran on and off until September 1, 1979. A total of 15 half-hour episodes were made. Topic: <laughs> Cast. The program starred veteran actor Jonathan Harris, best known as Dr. Zachary Smith of Lost in Space, co-starring were Pamela Ferdin, Rick Carrot, Maggie Cooper, Brian Tochi, Ty Henderson, and Eric Green. The program featured a pint-sized robot called, Peepo, a radio-controlled machine voiced by Erica Scheimer talking through a pitch shifter with regenerative delay. Guest stars included Lawrence, Larry. Dobkin, Dina Dietrich, Mother Nature, in the chiffon margarine TV commercials of the 1960s and 70s, George DeCenzo, Dallas McKennan, and Howard Morris. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Concepts. Established in the Star Year. 3732, the Space Academy, located on an asteroid, brought together the best of young minds, including several with special skills and abilities, to explore the mysteries of space. Commander Isaac Gampu Harris was the head of the Academy. His many years of space exploration exposed him to conditions that immensely slowed his aging process, though appearing to be in his 60s or 70s, his true age was well over 300 years old, giving him a unique perspective on history and some ideal qualifications as a teacher. He oversaw the activities of three student exploratory teams, the Red, Blue and Gold teams although the main characters were all members of the Blue team. Chris Gentry and Laura Gentry were the captain and co-captain, respectively, of the Academy's blue team. The siblings Chris was the elder had highly developed telekinetic and other psychic powers. Laura was attracted to Matt Prentice John Berwick, the occasionally seen leader of the red team. Adrian Price Jones Cooper was number three in the blue team's chain of command and Chris's love interest. Paul Jerome Henderson, a highly intelligent transferee from the Red Team, was raised on an Earth colony. He was number four in the Blue Team's chain of command. Although Paul is introduced as an established Academy member in the first episode, he is reintroduced in the second episode as if he were a new character. Conversely, Loki, introduced in the first episode as a new admission, is reintroduced in the second episode as a long established member. This continuity error was acknowledged in the information booklet accompanying the series DVD release. T. Gar Soom Tochi, number 5 in Blue Team's chain of command, had superhuman physical strength and continued the martial arts traditions of his Asian ancestors. He augmented these abilities with newer disciplines, some of which originated on other planets. Loki Green was a young orphan discovered in the first episode on the dying world of Zalan. A playful prankster, Loki could teleport and could see well beyond the visible spectrum normally accessible by Earth humans. His frequent catchphrase was, Camelopardus. As with much of children's television in the 1970s, lessons and morals were taught in each episode. These included wide-ranging concepts, such as that the superpowers possessed by some Academy students were not a cure-all for problems, and that even the old and wise could make mistakes. As the students encountered members of extraterrestrial races, even mutated descendants of Earth colonists in space, they came to further develop their wisdom and understanding of diversity throughout the universe. The spaceships commonly seen in the series were called Seekers and were used much like a spacebound van or bus. The Sika's nose was a reused prop from the earlier Filmation series Arc 2. One term of jargon unique to the program was, ORACO, orders received and carried out, used when orders were acknowledged by Academy personnel. Topic. Episode list Top.
Topic: Merchandise. In 1977, Aviva Toy Company manufactured an FW Woolworth distributed a set of four eight and a half inch action figures based on Space Academy characters. The dolls in this set included Isik Sik Gampu, described as instructor in Space Academy, T Gar Sum, almost superhuman strength, Chris Gentry, member of Space Academy, and Loki, everybody's mascot. Also available for the figures were special adventure outfits. Sold separately. Topic DVD release BCI Eclipse LLC under its Ink and Paint Classic Animation Entertainment brand under license from Entertainment Rights, released Space Academy, the complete series as a four-disc Region 1 DVD box set on January 16, 2007. The collection presented episodes uncut, remastered and in order of their original air dates, and included special features about the making of the show. As of 2011, the set is out of print, due to the closure of BCI Eclipse by its parent company, Navar Corporation, in December 2008. <laughs> Spin-off In 1978, a spin-off of Space Academy, Jason of Star Command, debuted. Initially a serialized segment of Tarzan and the Super 7, it starred Craig Littler and James Doohan, with Sid Haig as the villain. Star Command was described as a special section of the Space Academy. The show used the same sets, costumes and special effects as the parent program. <laughs> 